I, I bull rushed dude, and then, you know, he tried to get his hands on me, so I used my hands, the swim move. And then I kind of, like, pushed the guard. That was just easier for me to get to the quarterback. And then, you know, I thought he still had the ball in his hands, and then I saw uh, number 21, Darion Barley, running for a touchdown, and I was like, yes, yes. <laughs> Tell me about this magical season you guys are having so far. One more game. The season's been great. You know, we've been, we've been working hard. We made sure that this game was going to be the last. We grind all summer, all spring, so that way we were ready. We didn't. We we wanted to go for, we wanted to go for a better, a better championship than last year. This this week, my 99-year-old grandmother died, and she just infused loving to me and to him and he felt that and he knew her and he's worked so hard like she just knew she was strong in education and endurance and Achille knew that and he knew he said he I played for her this week and I believe it and he worked so hard he was very emotional this week but he worked so hard to get this point he's an honor roll student he's focused in education I can't even say enough about my son he's amazing and I'm so excited to see where he's gonna go I'm seriously so he's got so much energy and excitement he's amazing Talk to me about this defense and how you guys prepared for Valley. Uh, we just worked hard all week, made sure we were in good condition. And, you know, we didn't we didn't let the De La Salle loss, you know, we didn't let it get to us. At the end of the day, you got to keep going. So we made sure we worked, made sure we prepared for this week. And we already, you know, we already knew it wasn't going to be an easy win. We already knew it was going to be a dog fight, so he's ready. He's a sophomore. He's doing amazing. Um, he's really working. I haven't had to work with him as far as school-wise. Like school-wise, he's great. He knows his academics. He can organize himself. He can get himself together. He can do his work. He knows how to stay. He stays up late. He asks mom if he needs help. He asks me. He's a great academic student as well as athletic. And he's a Letterman for for sure. He's a Letterman man. And he's he's an amazing kid. He really is focused on his future. He's doing amazing things. He's a great player. He's really good. Uh, we he he played the end in the middle, like uh, the beginning of the season. They moved him to the T tackle, and he's just been a monster ever since. He's uh, he just got past that dude and made a big sack. It was amazing. This week is very very tough for him. He's very emotional about last week and the loss, but he worked very hard, especially with my grandmother passing. Um, he knew how hard my grandmother believed in the foundation. My grandfather was the first Mexican principal in Los Angeles School District. And because of that, he knows how important it is for kids to work hard and fo face adversities and challenges and just be focused in the future. I love him. I'm, I'm looking forward to these dubs, man. I'm looking forward to just working hard and just getting to where I want to be in life. So, I mean, that's all it is, just hard work.